Hello everyone and uh, welcome to Forkmas's vlog for the Age of Sigmar fantasy setting of this of this vlog. Uh, today I'm reviewing the, the Age of Sigmar 4th edition trailer which is an animation in on itself. Since it's only a trailer we do not know who wrote the story or anybody in the roles as we see in it. And since I've rebranded this channel into a fantasy slash Ace of Sigmar, I am starting over with all of my numbering reviews. So that's, this is going to be number one of my animation reviews. Let's see what this story is all about. So if you watched my previous reviews about the Black Talon series, much of which is conveyed in this trailer returns from that series. This trailer starts out with a woman being hunted down by Sangors in a frozen tundra of an unknown place. When she is killed and about to be taken by Nagash, the ruler of the dead, she was taken by Sigmar and reforged as a Stormcast Eternal. It then flashes several of her lives as she is killed by different fractions. Towards the end of the trailer, a huge green landmass sprouts out from the ground next to the a Sigmarite Free Gilded City, where untold numbers of rats and skaven are unleashed upon the city. The regular humans sounds the bells as Stormcast Eternals are brought in by lightning to handle the situation. We are once again shown the same woman taking off her helmet, revealing that she is filled with scars and her eyes are empty voids of lightning. As was brought up in Black Talon is that every time a Stormcast dies and is reforged, a little bit of their soul is carved out and, and disappears. I saw a comment that the eyes are the windows to the soul and this could be a hint of at how little of her original soul remains intact. As the previous teaser suggested and that she states throughout the, the, the tra this trailer is that Sigmar lied to them, so there might be a huge revelation in the future to come for this fraction. It ends on this note, so what did I think about this episode? You might be wondering why I should talk about this first on my rebranded fantasy channel and it just came to me randomly and it's kind of new so I felt it was very topical and uh, recent. I think the animation is top tier amazing. In some close-ups I would have sworn that it's done with real life actors and not just uh, digital uh, computer work. The voice actress does a decent job of narrating unclear things about the plot. If I were to complain it is that there isn't much more of this and it's just a trailer. But I imagine it takes a lot of time to process and make something like this. So I will give this trailer a 9 out of 10 forks and with that I will conclude this animation review. Thank you very much for watching this animation review. See you around everybody. Bye bye.